Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Music Marketing TV. I'm Dan D, and thanks for tuning in to Recording Effects on Total Mix Effects for the Babyface. So in this episode, I'm going to basically show you how to monitor your effects or how to record them. All right? So um, right now you're listening to what I would hear through the speakers um, because of the loopback feature. All right? So if I turn on my effects here and I have the effects panel out, I turned on my reverb. I have it set to a very long reverb tail so we can just hear the difference. And then I'm going to go to my master output my hardware output and I'm gonna turn up the effects check, check. Super reverb. All right. now if I were to just monitor it I can take off the loopback feature so now I'm basically going to just listen to the effects in the background everything I record will be flat so I should come out on the left hand side check one check two and we're gonna try this with it off alright I'm gonna go into my DAW, which is FL Studio. I'm going to set this to analog one. This is my microphone. Check, check. See, we are getting a reading. And I'm going to take this off. I want to sub it. I don't want to sub the output of channel one to my mixer, to my main master, rather, just so we don't have an echo happening. All right. So I'm going to hit record. I should hear nothing. Check one, check two. There is no reverb. Check one, check two. All right. So now, just so we can listen to that, I have to enable my loopback feature, just so you guys can hear what's coming out of my software playback. All right, now I'm gonna have my volume set to somewhere in the middle so that I don't get any feedback, okay? Or you guys don't get any feedback. And let's take a listen. Check one, check two. There is no reverb. Check one, check two. Now, if I simply want to record the reverb, I'm gonna go into the effects and pull that up. Go to effects, turn, and you hear the long tail. I'm gonna hit record now, and it should pick up that reverb. Check one, super reverb. All right. So now, take this off, and I have the loopback feature on still, so we can hear my software playback, which is FL Studio, and we should hear the reverb. Let's check it out. Check one, super reverb. All right, folks, that's basically it for this tutorial. I showed you guys how to monitor your effects or record your effects. Okay, guys, just by simply using this loopback feature. I'm Dandy from Music Marketing TV, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode.